What's going on tonight, family? I hope you guys are having a beautiful and blessed night tonight. Uh, I want to talk about a word that I got. And um, I was in Isaiah chapter 61. And um, it was these three verses. And these three verses really was like, you know, really pulled on my spirit. So, you know, as I was reading that, all I heard was the time of favor has arrived for my people. The time of favor has arrived for my people. And it just kept repeating. Before I get into all that, I want to recite these scriptures for you guys. We're going to Isaiah chapter 61, verses 1 through 2. And it says, The Spirit of the Lord God is upon me. Because the Lord has anointed me to preach good tidings to the poor, he has sent me to heal the brokenhearted, to proclaim liberty to the captives, and the opening of the prison to those who are bound, to proclaim the acceptable year of the Lord, and the day of vengeance of our God, to comfort all who mourn. And then Isaiah chapter 61, verse 7. Instead of your shame, you shall have double honor. And instead of confusion, they shall rejoice in their portion. Therefore, in their land, they shall possess double. Everlasting joy shall be theirs. So I'm not even going to lie to you guys. I recommend you guys to read the whole Isaiah chapter 61. But basically, the person speaking in this chapter is Isaiah, the prophet Isaiah. And, you know, he explains to the people of Israel how he is anointed and how he's chosen and appointed for that time, you know, to help out the children of Israel. He explains about how many of the children of Israel that are in exile, many of them will be set free. He talks about how they will no longer be bound by the things that will keep them captive. He talks to them about preaching the good news. He talks about how he is sent to heal the brokenhearted and the broken in spirit. But a lot of people don't catch on to what he said in verse 2. To proclaim the acceptable year of the Lord in the day of vengeance of our God to comfort all who mourn. So what the prophet Isaiah is saying is that there have been many people in the nation of Israel who've been mourning over the captivity who've been feeling so bounded and oppressed. But he is saying that he was sent by God to tell the people of Israel that the favor of God has arrived. But at the same time, vengeance of the Lord will be set upon their enemies, which is, I swear to you, is the same thing that the Lord told me regarding to 2023. And he tells them that instead of your shame, you should have double portion. Instead of confusion, they will rejoice in that inheritance. Therefore, in their land, they will possess double, meaning God will bless them double than what they had before. And that joy will be theirs. So I'm here to tell you guys right now, the favor of God is upon God's people right now. The blessings of God is overflowing through the body of Christ. God is rising up his remnant in this hour. God is putting together kingdom marriages. God is opening up doors for people that they would never thought those doors would ever open. God is blessing his people tremendously in this hour. But at the same time, many of those who have not been living right for Christ, backsliding, lukewarm, non-believer, vengeance will be the Lord's in this hour without repentance. But for the children of God, congrats, you're walking in God's favor.